Now, the living water, the living water, the living water, Jesus. is only in Judah. So if you want to know what God is doing in your life and wants you to do, you have to come through me. In Judah, we are all doing the same thing with the same Holy Spirit, the only Holy Spirit. This provides clarity and not confusion, and it also provides accountability on your part. If you feel confused, you are doing something wrong. <clears throat> so there's one kingdom of God, God's kingdom, God's church. This is something you should rejoice about. Because you get answers quicker, you get results quicker, you get day by day daily bread, you get nourished, replenished, strengthened, whole. And your kingdom spouse is your other half of your spirit. Many will have the testimony. Wait, did you pray for a kingdom marriage? Be careful what you pray for. And that is only going to be the beginning of their testimony. Then it's, and I still can't stop thanking God. So you, as I have been stating for two years, I've been wasting precious moments of happiness and joy with your spouse. You prayed for a new thing. You prayed, Lord, thank you for the manna, but can we come out of the wilderness? I've never been good with muttering, but I'm being more open to learning about why. The afflictions, the hurts, I always said I wouldn't teach a Christian that lukewarm Christians can't be saved. <clears throat> so understand you're coming from the enemy's camp and my preaching has slightly changed because there are things I'm allowed to say and things into the kingdom of God. Hello, welcome back to Profit and Diary. My name is Tiny. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, I don't know what you're waiting for. Get connected to the channel. I release daily bread videos every morning to get your morning started, get, to get you motivated so that you're steadfast in the word throughout the day. Why would you start your day without prayer? Why would you start your day without a word? So welcome everyone to know more and get to know more about Profit and Diary or myself, how to sign up for coaching calls, join us in a single and ready series this what Saturday at 12 noon, our PD Society Circle, Sunday at 10, we're going to be talking about radical faith, you don't want to miss out on everything that we have going on here at Confident Diary because we are birthing the new, many of you are feeling birth and praying and cramps and you're feeling some pressure on your life, that is because God is doing a new thing, all right? So join us. Everything is down below, keywitnesses.com. Sign up for that call. I love talking to you guys. I actually have calls all day today. 
I'm super excited. Love to get to know you guys. Love helping you build your business. Love helping you bring, get some clarity in your life. So sign up for that one-on-one -on -one encouragement call. Keywinningsense.com. So the Lord gave me a word to me, and I'm happy that he gave this word. Okay? It says, in the camp, they grew envious of Moses and Aaron, who was consecrated to the Lord. Okay, hear me. Follow me, follow me. Somebody say, follow me, follow me. We're in Psalms 106, 16. You're going to see people of your past, and I say your past because they're in your past, because the things that they do are so in your past. But Aaron was a priest consecrated by God, and Moses was called to deliver these same people that's envious of them, them same people that you had conversation after conversation after conversation with, that you tried to deliver, that tried to pull them out of poverty mindset, tried to pull them out of the gutters that they was in, tried to pull them out of the world. Right? That refused. So now they're trying to take the little bit of crumbs, the, the big past women, a counterfeit girlfriend that measures nothing to what you got going on. I'm not trying to be mean, but it's just not that. It's not fruitful. And now they're going to try to use these women and people and other co workers, and they're going to try to promote people above you to try to make you jealous. But how you going to make me jealous if y'all on level three and I'm on level 11? I don't even know what's going on on level three, so how can you possibly make me mad? This is Moses and Aaron that we're talking about. Moses was the one that was calling the shots. Moses is the one that y'all needed for direction and guidance. Moses was the goat. Aaron was the priest consecrated by God. So somebody's saying, you're on the wrong team. They were, they're on the wrong team. You're shooting air balls. We're still in the month of March Madness. Somebody's saying, you're shooting air balls. And it says in the desert, they gave into their cravings. You gave into your cravings. You gave into that Delilah. You gave into that other woman because of her looks or, 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 or whatever she got going on. You gave into that. And you thought that I was going to stick around for your mess. No. Go have fun with whatever you chose. Somebody say, enjoy your choices. And they're trying to make you jealous and they're trying to make you mad and trying to get you upset because that's all that they have. Because they're in their feelings, they want you to be in your feelings. But somebody say, I've elevated. Somebody's saying, all things work together. I thank God for that other woman that came. Because if she never came, it wouldn't have separated me from you. If you never promoted that other employee over me, I would have never left that job. Somebody say, thank you. So they grew more jealous of Aaron and Moses because they was blessed. Because they was doing the work of the Lord and they had the proofs to prove it. And y'all gave into y'all cravings. It says, in the de desert, they gave into their cra cravings. In the wasteland, they put God to the test. So he gave them to what they lusted after. You lusted after the world. You lusted after that woman. You lusted after those things. And now you're stuck with them. And you're mad at me. Somebody saying, I have moved on. I have moved on. Somebody say, y'all have time. Somebody say, jealous of what? Somebody say, jealous of what? Mm. Moses was <laughs> Moses was the one calling the shots. Why would he be jealous? Moses was blessed and highly favored. He was trying to give them commands that would help their life, and they was trying to burn them. Y'all gossiping about me. Somebody say, you gossiping about me, and I was the one that was helping this family and then breathing life into this family. I was the one that helped you get the down payment for your car. I was on, somebody say, they don't remember, but the Lord's to me here to let you know that they're trying to make you jealous. <laughs> they're trying to make you jealous. Somebody say, that's my bad. So I hope that this word bless you. If you feel like this on to a hashtag, I won't give in. I won't give in. I'm moving on. Somebody say, y'all have fun. God bless. Hope to see y'all this Saturday in the Single Ready series. I may be going live a little later today. Well done, Tiny. Perfect.